How's it going, sister mates? This is Mr. Charles, and we're back with Yu-Gi-Oh! Nightmare Troubadour. And things are getting exciting. I'm against Bandit Keith. I'm not in America, but I'm fucking against him. And I don't know what he's got. He could have something good or something fucking terrible. But we're going to see that now. We're going to see how good this boy is. Okay, if I actually get the game started. There we go. Sorry, I wasn't selecting the game properly. All right. I don't know what combination I want to go for here. I'm going to start with a defense. And then see what happens. My idea is that he'll sacrifice and I'll be able to use Hain Hain or something. Or, you know, maybe not. Maybe he'll be a dick all about it. We'll see what he does. What have you got? Oh, a mechanical. Well, that's not going to save you. Was that my mechanical chaser by any chance? Alright, yeah, nice try. That's not going to work for you, friend. Sorry. Cool. It's a good thing I did keep Miss Glove because I was going to get rid of her for Cruel. I'm sure I've still got Cruel somewhere in this deck. It's just, you know. His defenses go. They're very useful in this game. Okay, what can I get? Uh, Rush Recklessly. That can come in handy later. Well, I could use it now, but I don't want to. Uh, right, so I'm going to set Hain Hain. And then I'm thinking he's going to have something with... Actually, I could even set my Rush Recklessly when I'm at it. I'm thinking he's going to sacrifice with two monsters. He might not, but you know, I could try. No? Oh, he's fissuring me. What dick move? Alright, fine. Oh, he's got three monsters out. Shit. Really? I'm surprised. I thought you'd have something decent, man. Alright, I'm just going to use Wabaku, I guess. Fuck it, why not? Uh, no, that's fine. Cool. Now I can use my Hain Hain effect. I wonder if I have a Penguin Soldier, because doesn't that clear two monsters out? I might double check if I have one. I, I think I might. Or maybe I have a Penguin Knight, I don't know. But regardless, uh, get rid of uh, Robotic Knight, I guess. Cool. Okay, now I can clear all his monsters out, which is a good thing. So get Copycat out. Yes. Get to copy the living shit out of something. Yeah, that's mine. Thank you. Wish it was on my side, though, but fuck it. Right, I'll use... No, not that yet, because then he's going to get rid of Gradius. Use this, yes. Attack the Gradius, the spaceship. Sorry, spaceship. You're going to have a crash landing. <laughs> okay, this is fine. So, despite having loads of machines, he's actually been quite faithful to his deck, which is something I'm noticing this game does, like... It does actually have, like, we gets insects, Rex gets, like, dinosaurs. It could have done whatever it wanted, but it didn't. Um, despite that, this guy's shit. You know, I thought he'd actually be a decent player, but he's just as disappointing as everyone else. Although Panic was quite good, to be honest. You didn't get to see Panic, because that was an off-screen thing, but, you know. He was actually quite good at the game with his Castle Dark Illusion. And I think he might have had a Pumpkin as well, but I don't know. Okay, what have you got now, friend? A machine. Alright, you can get your monsters back if you must, but I don't know what that's going to do for you. Yeah, we get your Gradius and your Chaser. Still not going to do... Oh, Pot of Greed. You're going to get even more shit out. Maybe that's a good. Well, I mean, if he was smart, he would have just got his mechanical chest put in attack mode, but he didn't. Okay, I'm going to get treasure chest. I could use this to my advantage. So what's that thing? A tribute doll. So he clearly does have level 7s, he just doesn't want to use them, because he is incompetent. He failed, you know, his basic maths GCSEs. So I'm guessing the next monster he'd get out would be Mechanical Chaser. And then I could just fuck him over with, with my Rush Recklessly, if I'm honest. Because <laughs> he's an idiot. But that's fine, maybe I'll even get another monster and clear the match next turn. Or maybe the game will be just gay and make this last even longer. But regardless... You know, Bandit Keith, you know, he's banned at this game because he's so bad at it. <laughs> that was me trying to do a good pun. It wasn't that good. It was quite a bad pun. All right. Yeah, he's doing exactly what I thought he'd do. Yeah, you're going to attack. But you're going to be an idiot about it because I fucking saw that 50 years away. 50 light years away. You're not even that subtle. Actually, you're pretty gay. Yeah, just waste your attack. Just go to the graveyard. Have a nice vacation dying. Alright, now I could get Sangra Thunder out. But I can't be asked for that bullshit, so I'm not going to. Ooh, but Shadow Grave. 
Do I have anything good in my graveyard? I don't think I do. <laughs> I have a Hainane, if that's of any interest. Which it isn't. Uh, no, I'll set my man to bug. Maybe I'll use Shallow Grave on him. Cool. Although I wouldn't be able to flip him on that turn, will I? Will I? I don't think I'll be able to. Still, Shallow Grave is really useful if you want some, like, flip effects to work again. I mean, it worked great with Morphing Jar. I can use that, like, twice a game now. Uh, but I can only have one Morphing Jar, which is, you know, you know, fine. I mean, as far as I know, Morphing Jar is banned, but at least it's a fun card to use. Like, I don't know why it's banned. I'm sure something bad would happen, but still. Right, yeah, you're gonna, you're gonna try and attack my bug. Oh, that's a shame. Yeah, you're a fucking idiot, but if you, if you really want to be an idiot that bad, good for you. Good for fucking you, I guess. Right, yeah, destroy the space. No! Oh, I'm an idiot! Oh, fuck. Why would you select my monster first? Ah, fine. You know what? The game was too easy anyway. Maybe I'll draw a monster now. Not a fucking good one. Hmm. Okay, that might have been a bit stupid. Annoying thing is, I could use the Shallow Grave. And then get out Sanger. But then he'd have 50, 50 fucking life points left. God damn it, I was just bored, okay? I don't want to fucking keep doing this shit. Alright, I'm just going to set Time Wizard and uh, just fucking attack. If you get something good out, then maybe next turn I'll be able to kill him. Oh, for, for God's sake, why did I let that happen? Why am I an idiot? Why am I the one that didn't pass GCSE maths now? I actually got an A in GCSE maths. That was brilliant. Alas, I didn't get an A in English. I think I got like a... Well, I think I got an A in literature, but a C in language, so I count it as a, you know, a, a B. Okay, fine, yeah, good for you, you're fucking good at the game. Yes, and unfortunately, if I attack that, he would still have fucking 50 life points left. Good, great. That's not, that's not what I need. Oh, no, wait, hold on, maybe I can use that. If I... No, that won't work. Does this kind of actually just think good? I can't destroy a dragon because there's no dragons on the field. I don't want him to get something. I don't even know what he has in his fucking graveyard, to be honest. Uh, nothing in particular. Alright, well, I want to fucking get rid of him. I don't want to get something good out. So I guess we're going to take this even slower now. This game's going too fast. It's going to be slower than an anime battle. Alright, now he's on 650. Slowly whittling him away. Slowly burning away his soul. Yeah, if they're doing that y Yama Yugi versus Merrick thing where they burn each other's other halves as the uh, life points went down, then Bandit would be in. Bandit keeps being in extreme pain right now. Why are you in attack mode? Why do you not care? Okay, well, I'm just gonna bone you now because I can't be asked. I actually can't be asked. Good. Equip the Dragon Seeker. Thank you for choosing my monster this time. We'll do that. And then literally destroy you. Good. Thank God that's over with. He wasn't even that good. I gave him a chance to get something good out. And he didn't fucking take it. So he was fucking useless. Hooray. Good. Do I get decent points because this is a newbie? A new guy? A new little piece of shit? Uh, Alright. So I can get some decent points out of that. 60 more points, I would have been able to get like four packs of cards, but I guess I'm not having that this time. Ah! Hey, you die! Don't act like a know it all because you beat me. Well, I did though, so if I can give him back the prize you stole. Prize? I don't know what you're talking about. I only do it because you challenged me. Well, is he actually a decent guy now, is he? That's not funny! Haha! <laughs> See ya, chumps! Alright, but he's blonde and shit. Wait! Bandit Keith left. Joey, are you okay? Yeah, Yugi, I'm alright. Except for my pounding headache. What, from getting, from playing a card game? How did you get... What, because you lost so badly? You're like, ah, How am I going to forgive myself? Alright, cool. Thank, thanks, to Yugi, die. Yeah, you're trying to kill Yugi there. Ha, <laughs> so funny. That joke's still funny years later. No, thank you, Joey, for having my back. Alright, cool. Good to know that Joey's my bestie now. After all that, I didn't get my grand prize. Really? What even was the grand prize? Let's already return. Alright, well. 
I guess we can conclude the night. I don't know what comes up next, but I guess I'll figure that out another time. All right, I can go to sleep. Maybe someone will wake me up. Maybe I'll get an email. Maybe I'll be able to, like, instantly enter the expert tournament. But I do know I'm going to have to find Pegasus at some point in order to get, like, a booster pack or some shit. So, okay, it's morning. Oh, something's happening. Whoa! Where the fuck am I? Seto, Yugi called me. He said that the thief escaped. Huh. I knew he'd fail, but who has the gall to tarnish my tournament? I'm going to use all Kaiba Corp's resources to find the crook, no matter where he's hiding. He'll never- he'll regret ever taking me on. Yeah, I don't even know why he stole it. Was there even anything good? Oh, okay. You decided to visit my home, Seto. <laughs> Seto would never do this. The card shop made sense because there was there potentially a blue eyes there. But he just, he just came in my home. All right, hey, Seto, can I make you some tea? Well, I don't have a kitchen or anything, but I'm coming in. <laughs> huh? <laughs> what the fuck? I'm Seto Kaiba, president of Kaiba Corp. Are you die the winner of the Beginner's Cup? Y yes, sir. Your prize was stolen and the thief escaped. I'm sure you're no happy camper. So I get a new dual disc? That's why I'll give you Kaiba Corp's newest innovation. Upgrade parts for your dual... What? Wait, what? What what the hell is it going to provide me with that I don't already have? Use them to find the punk with your own hands. These upgrades to take powerful duelists and points you in their direction. I'll also give these parts to the other duelists so that we can trap the thief in no time. So I get... Is this actually going to allow me to detect the duelists I want to detect? Because I would fucking love that. I have no doubt that the criminal is a duelist. And only a high level duelist could pull off such, pull off such a crime. Because, you know, you need good dueling skills to be able to steal, you know? Find him and beat him in a duel. Maybe then you'll get your pride back. What if, like, in, this, in the Yu-Gi-Oh! universe, to, like, crack a safe or something, the, the, the thief has to play the safe at a, a card game? Why not? All right, bye. I, I don't want to go to sleep, thank you. So what does the outside look like? Can I actually find Duelist on the spot now? Oh. Because those upgrade parts must do something decent. Uh, hello? Oh, it says there's star level. Oh, that's great. Okay, who else is there? Uh, who's over here? You're one star, so I'm not bothering with you because you're useless. You know, your, your parents disowned you because you're so bad at card. You're also disowned by your family because you're such a fucking little fucking gay boy. Right, I mean, potentially these guys, you're not telling me anything. Should I maybe look into that? I want to kind of look at new cards, but let's see what we got here. Uh, I wonder where the Beginner's Cup Finals will be held. I want to be there live. You know what's really cool? When a duelist uses a powerful combo, kapow. You're an idiot. That finished ages ago. But, you know, you do you, I guess. All right, so I'm guessing if they're blank, they're not duelists. Who's over here? Anyone? Anybody? Not doing a one star. I want to see if I can get, like, a four star. Because I might, I might have played one of those, but, you know, I could handle it. I'm not even struggling with anyone yet. There's going to be another three star about somewhere. Where's my three star? Where's my three star hotel? You know, at least there's not any like bug marks on the wall. Because it's a three star hotel. Where are you? What? Has he literally disappeared? Has he gone for a fag or something? No, nothing. Am I not even going to... Oh, wait, there's someone down there. I think. Yeah, there's someone here. I'm not going to challenge him or anything. I just want to see if I can find him. I want to play Where's Wally? Is Wally over here? Is Wally over here? Wally, where the fuck are you? There. Oh, that's the three star. Cool. And I am kind of tempted to play him, but no, I want cards first. Maybe for dealing with the bullshit I had to deal with to get my fucking prize or whatever. Maybe I'll be able to see like, some new card packs. I don't know. All right, what we got in here? Anything nice? Anything good? Anything fun? No, there's nothing new. All right. But I do want to get 80% with Broken Seal. So I'm going to see if I can do that first. Probably be nothing good in here, but we'll just take a look-see. Right. No, no. That's new, I think. Yeah, that is new. So what does White Magic Hat do again? I mean, that's okay if I could, you know, do damage with a White Magical Hat. All right, I've got 80%, so I should be able to see the card list now. There we go. Hi, Dai. You have a lot of cards. Let me give you this list. Cool, thank you. Now, what cards am I actually missing? I want to know. Is it here? 
No, it's not here. Is it? Is it here? Uh, card list. So I've got 80% of this. So there's left arm. Is that the only Exodia piece I'm missing? Yes. Okay. Well, I wouldn't mind making an Exodia deck, but there's not going to be a huge potential to draw cards, is there? So, because this is still early in the game, I think, like, at least in Legacy of the Duelists and stuff, there's new cards to help you draw, but you got to, like, pay a fair few costs. Uh, Sorcerer of the Doomed. I don't know why I don't have that. Uh, Buster Blader. I did want that, but it's not going to be much use now. And no one uses dragons. Dimensional Warrior. I don't know what that is, but I hear card names are kind of changed in... Nightmare Troubadour, just a faith. That would be semi handy. Uh, Guy the Dragon Champion, useless. Acid Rain, that just destroys machines. That just destroys insects. Uh, Graceful Dice, I don't need that. And Tribute to the Doomed. So, Tribute to the Doomed, potentially handy. Other than that, all these cards are shit. I mean, I could get that Exodia piece, but I don't really want it. Alright, fine. So, that, that area is useless to me. Okay, fine. Um, so I could try and collect all these other stuff as well. But honestly, I want to... I could do Inherited Will too. Now, I want to try and get Relinquished. I actually do want Relinquished in my deck. It's just I'm not going to have that many one-star monsters, am I? So, you know, that's going to be promising. Uh, oh, and I, I can get Relinquished in now. Oh, and there's a Thousand Eyes Restrict. I could potentially get that in if I... Well, if I use that, um, bitch tits and a polymerization, I mean, heck, I wouldn't even need to have my, um, uh, what was it? I wouldn't even need to summon Relinquish in the first place. I could just get Thousand Eyes Restricted out anyway. But aren't you, like, banned? Select one monster and put it the field. Okay, so if this card is destroyed, it destroys the post button. Well, okay, I mean, that, that might be a bit fun to use. If, if I can use polymerization. Alright, first off, I actually do kind of want to... Oh, should I pull that other card pack first? I'm going to see if I can do it. I mean, I, I've never actually been able to use a Thousand Eyes Restrict because they're always banned and, you know, they're kind of hard to collect. But, you know, right, I'll get this front one, what we got, and think nice. Anything good for me? Uh, well, a lot of new shit. Ooh, Legendary Fisherman. Right. You can activate this card when your opponent draws a card outside of his draw phase. I'm not going to do that. Uh, I don't need that. Jiggin could potentially be good. Wait. After this card is flipped, offer it as a tribute during your standby phase. Destroy all monsters on your side of the field and flip that. Oh, well, I'm not doing that. Uh, okay, fine. Cool. I don't mind that. But... If I wanted to, if I was a good boy for Christmas, which I always am, you know, I do try my best. Could I add a Thousand Eyes Restrict to my deck? Where's the, t uh, no, I need to go in my trunk. T4000. Where the fuck is it? That's relinquished, but. Uh, no, I mean, it must be banned, surely. It's not banned. Huh. Alright, well, I'm in the mood for a bit of chaos, so let's fucking do it. You can go in my deck. So you're going to be a fusion. Now, I know I've got one polymerization. So I'll put that in the deck as well. And then... Oh, I do have a penguin soldier. Okay, well, that's going in as well. And I'm also going to get in that fucking bitch who I've forgotten the name of. Oh dear, that's going to annoy me. Can I fucking recognise her maybe? I don't, I don't have that many cards, but... Hmm. Oh dear. I appear to have made a mistake in trying to make a deck. In the, in which I, I forgot the name of that bitch. It's like Mistress of the Third Eye or something, or... I think it begins with M. Damn it, where are you, bitch? Oh, there you are. Goddess of the Third Eye. Okay. So do... That... Should I get two in there? No, because I only have one relinquish. I don't want to do the ritual monster. Because I'd rather just get, like, relinquish out instantly. Uh, 
I mean, I wish I had more fusions. I mean, like, if I had, like, a cannon soldier in, I could get, like, a labyrinth tank out as well. But I don't... I don't know. I, I, I don't have much faith in, like, ritual... Uh, sorry, fusion monsters anyway. I don't even think I have that many, to be honest. Uh, I'm not going to worry about getting, like, loads of fusions in. I'm just going to see what I can get out and then just... What do I just do? No, I don't need that. No, fuck off. Right, so I need to get rid of three cards if I want to do this. So, you shouldn't be there. Because I don't draw you, but I could be wrong. Oh, I put four cards in, didn't I? Right, I need to get rid of Hain Hain. You can go in the trunk. Uh, what else can I get rid of? I don't think I'm going to really use Mucus Yolk. Because he's, he's got specific conditions. Which I didn't realise, so you can go in the trunk. And what was the last card I put in? Oh, it was a polymerization, wasn't it? So maybe I should get rid of a magic. I kind of don't want to, if I'm honest. I don't really use Time Wizard. He's not as useful as I thought he'd be. But he. He could still be useful if I get lucky. Nah, I'm not going to use him. Alright, fine. So I've got Thousand Eyes Restrict in my deck. I mean, I also have a Relinquished, but I can't use Relinquished, unfortunately. Uh, but that, that's fine. I'm not too worried about that. Maybe I'll be able to use him. But am I going to use him? Am I going to use him good? I guess we'll see that in the next episode. But yeah, if you want to play the game for yourself, have a bit of fun trying to, you know, thrash the competition, substituting monsters, there will be a link to the game in the description down below. And without further ado, big bit of scrub channel until next time. See ya!